All right, uh, starting off, Coach, uh, Cougars coming off uh, two great wins on the road at uh, Arizona State and Arizona. Uh, definitely two different types of matches that we saw, uh, pretty much how they played out. But, I mean, just kind of talk a little bit about, you know, sweeping Arizona State 3-0 and then kind of having to come back a little bit against Arizona there. Yeah, uh, you're right. First of all, to get two wins on the road is um, fantastic anytime and any way you can get it, we'll take it. Uh, but, yeah, I thought we played really pretty clean against Arizona State, um, and it's great to get that you know, 3-0 victory. We were down in the second set um, by quite a bit, and we were able to go on a run and come back and get ourselves back in that set and take it, um, so that's big. Um, and then, yeah, the you know second match against Arizona, being down 0-2 and down 23-21 in the third, we were pretty much dead in the water. Um, and, you know, credit to Arizona. They did a really nice job. They came out serving tough, uh, passing really well. You know, we weren't doing those two things. We weren't serving or passing very well. Um, but we're able to kind of get the momentum and take that third set and, and push it from there and able to then start getting, you know, Ella Leosh, um was pretty much unstoppable then the third, fourth, and fifth sets, which, um, you know, we needed that out of her. We needed some more. Um, production from our middles and then McKenna Woodford I thought um, just had a fantastic weekend um, at both schools as well. And you know speaking of McKenna you know surpassing 1,000 kill mark uh, at Arizona in her home state uh, you know 15th player in Washington State volleyball history to do so uh, also joins teammate Taylor Mims I mean first time that's really ever happened to have two players that hit the 1,000 career milestone. Uh, I mean what can you say just I mean, we've talked about McKenna so far this year, but, you know, as far as maybe how she's progressed as a player and especially how she, well she's been playing these past few weeks. Yeah, um, a huge congratulations to McKenna to get that milestone, especially being hurt last year. Um, just her recovery and her, her work ethic, especially, um, you know, all spring, summer, and this fall has been tremendous. I think she is um, just really taking advantage of every opportunity that she has. And it was so fun to see her play so well um, in front of so many friends and family down in Arizona. So um, yeah, we will of course need her to just continue with that um, to make us successful from here on out. Gotcha. And then, uh, you know, four match winning streak right now, three of those against ranked opponents in the Pac-12. I mean, what have you and your staff kind of seen over the past two weeks that's really clicking and working well for this team? Yeah, I, I think, um, you know, every match of, of those four matches has been a little bit different. You know, one match we, um, you know, passed well and played defense. One match we blocked extremely well. Another match we served well. Um, so I think uh, it's been a, a little bit of everything um, that has contributed to the success that we've had the last four matches. But um, especially going into this weekend, you know, it, it would be nice to kind of put all of those skills um, together and just be a little, a little bit more consistent and a little bit better, um, you know, in every single one of those categories. And, you know, I think that's what we're working to do every week is just get better and more consistent. And, you know, talk about going in this weekend on the road yet again, second straight week, uh, first against number two Stanford, uh, and then we'll take on Cal on that Sunday. Uh, you know, just first overall, just impressions and, you know, just kind of, you know, what's going to have to get done to take down, you know, both Stanford and Cal this week. Yeah, um, on the road again, feel a little bit like Willie Nelson, <laughs> you know. Um, but, you know, it'll hopefully pay off at the end of the season when we're home um, for quite a bit. But, you know, it's a tough road trip once again. Um, Stanford is obviously ranked number two this week, an extremely tough team, um, great all-around players, lots of weapons. And so um, to compete with them, like I said, we, we need to be more consistent and better in, in every single area, probably um, serving tough and getting our block going being the, the two main things. And then Cal um, also has been playing well lately. Um, you know, they got, got a great win, and that gives them momentum going into this weekend as well. So it's always tough, especially on the road, um, no matter who you're facing. And so we're just, you know, looking to get better every single day.